Okay, good morning, everybody, or good afternoon, whenever you're watching this. Um, I just wanted to come on here and give you guys another uh, workout. This one is going to be about 53 minutes. All you need is your mat, um, a light set of hand weights, um, soup cans, water bottles, or just your body, and a sturdy um, chair, counter, railing, whatever you're going to use for your sturdy surface. Bench, um, we'll do a little bit where you can use it, and then we're going to do some stuff on the floor today. So, I'm super excited. Post your sweaty selfies. I hope you guys like this. Start your watches. There is a bar um, fitness uh, workout in your Apple Watch if you guys use an Apple Watch. So, I always like to know what people burn during class. Um, so we will go ahead and get started. I will count you down to hit the playlist. I'm going to have it a little bit lower so that we don't get muted out of anything in this workout. So if you like to have the music louder, um, in the background you can, or just use anything and you can listen to me talking you through the cadence of everything. Um, otherwise we'll get ready to start in three, two, one. Alright, you are going to start in the middle of your mat, wide stance, or actually first position stance, arms right in front, toes out on a nice narrow V, you're going to need to be able to move side to side, you're going to step out to the right, so step out and in. In, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, out, four more, three more, two more, step to the left, step left and center, left and center. Dropping right down between those thighs. Eight more. Four more. Now we're going to alternate right to left. Two. Here we go. Step it. Right. Center. Left. Center. Right. And left. Right and left. I'm going to give you guys an option to bring this up a little higher to get those heart rates going. You can keep the step out, alternate, or you can hop out and in. This should get those heart rates pumping. Out and in. Out and in. Out and sliding on the mat. Four, three, two, one. Step it right and left. Right and left. Now hold it out and pulse it. Tiny little pulses. Catch your breath here. Eight, seven, six. Four more, three more, two more. Step it in, step in, step out, step in, step out, in, in. All the way in, all the way out, all the way in, all the way out. So keep it with the steps, or let's finish it out. Hopping, out and in, here we go. In and out. All the way up, all the way down. Three, two, and one. Grab those weights. Tummy's in nice and tight. You're just going to lift up and down. Hold them up, pulse it, 
bring them front. Thumbs to the ceiling. Palms to the ceiling. I'm going to show you from the side. You're going to drop them down on a diagonal. Curl those biceps in and out. In and out. Curl. Squeeze, squeeze, tiny pulses in, in, listen to the beat, squeeze, squeeze, eight, four, three, two, hold it here, pulse up. Four, three, two, circle in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring them back behind your back. Slight bend. Squeeze. Triceps here. Palms are facing the floor as you straighten the front of the body as you bring them in. Straighten and bend. Squeeze into those triceps. Tummy's in nice and tight. Nice flat back, so no arches in your back. Straighten and bend. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold them up and pulse it. Tiny pulses up. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Eight. Circles in, circles in, 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 in. It's tiny. Think no bigger than a quarter size. Four, three, two, one. Roll those shoulders. All right, weights are optional. I'm not going to use weights because I know what's coming. But if you guys want to use weights, you can always drop down. So just keeping those feet about hip distance. Those arms tee right out to the side. Palms facing the floor, shoulders down into those pockets. You're just going to turn those arms forward and back. So you can see my arms are out in front. I'm engaging into my back muscles, squeezing from the shoulders all the way through those fingertips and knuckles. Twist, twist. down like you're slapping that water you're in the pool pat 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 you're squeezing you should see those muscles if you can see yourself in a window or a mirror look at how tight those muscles look so no flapping and if those arms start to bend and you're holding weights drop them use that body three two going to move. Left arm's going to stay straight out to the side. Right arm's going to reach and pull. Reach and pull. Reach and pull. Pushing that right shoulder blade towards that left hand. Reach and pull. Reach and pull. You should feel the tingle in that left arm. Alright, switch left. Reach and pull. Tingle in that right arm. Reach, pull, reach, pull. Three, two, both arms. Reach, 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 reach. You're pinching those shoulder blades as those elbows 
draw back. Keep those shoulders down and out of those ears. Reach, 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 reach. Eight, seven, six, five. They should be burning. Three, two, right back out to the center and circle. Breathe, reverse directions. Thumbs to the ceiling, pulse it up, 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 up. Palms to the ceiling, pulse it up, up. Squeeze those shoulder blades together, squeeze through those muscles. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, lower, roll those shoulders. You guys should have felt that. All the way down those arms. Woo! All right. We are going to do some bar burpees today. I'm going to show you all your options. So you do not need to do any kind of hopping or anything if you don't want to. You're going to start with those feet just outside those hips. Drive those arms up and down. Lower into a squat, pushing that bottom back towards that chair seat. All that weight is in those heels. All right, pulse for three, pulse at three. Two, one, and lift. Three, two, one, and lift. Back to singles, down and up. Four more. We're going to go into those burpees. Listen to my cue. Hands go down. Down and back. In and up. Or down, hop back. In and up. Or down, hop back. Hop in, hop up. Back to squat. Down and up. Down and up. Arms come up as you lower those bottoms. Woo! Y'all should feel those heart rates coming up. Pulse three. And lower. Or lower those arms, lift those hips. Two more like this. You're going to give me singles. Here we go. Squat, lift, squat, lift. I'll show you from the side. Squat and lift. Four. Three, we're going to do our burpees. Here we go. Down, back, in, and up. Feet go wide. As you step back and step in. Down, back, in. Eight more. Seven. Lower your back. Last one. Squat it. Down and up. Down and up. Lower and lift. Oh, please don't let me have lost you. Lower, lift, lower, lift. Hopefully that did not blur, guys. Two, last time, give me burpees. Down, back, in, and up. Squat it, down, and up, down, and up. Four, three, Two, and one. All right, you're gonna bring yourself 
to your supportive surface that you may need. You can always face it, or one hip can be um, to it and you can just use one hand to support you. You're gonna work in first position. So again, close everything up and open to those hips. Lift those heels, re-glue them, two counts, down and up. So from the side, you see I'm not hinging forward. You're sliding straight down. Those knees track out slightly over those toes, but your weight's in the back, so you're not gonna hurt those knees. Down, knees going out over those toes and up. Zipping at the top, tummy's in nice and tight. You're gonna give me nice, big, quick pulses. Down, up. Down, up, down, up. If you need to, keep those feet flat. Four, three, two, hold it low and pulse it. Down, down. Your heels act as though they're your hinge. It helps you feel it all the way up the side, outer part of your thigh and glute. Whether you're in um, releve, which is heels lifted, or flat foot. Keep going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here. Press those knees. Squeeze those cheeks. Push those hips forward. Press, press. Tiny little presses, squeezing right here. You feel those muscles working if you put your hands there. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here, big pulses. Up, down. Together. That's half the work right there. Press down. Four, three, hold it low, squeeze in and out, in and out. Let those heels be your hinge. Squeeze those inner thighs together. Do not hinge forward. You're not doing that. If you're keeping that back against your imaginary wall, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Four, three, two, one. All right. You are either going to have full extension of those arms, straight legs, or you're going to come to your forearms onto your stabilizing um, piece of furniture, whatever that is. If you have full arms, I want those biceps next to those ears. Start with those feet parallel and together. Push into the back of those knees, curl that tailbone up, lift those heels up, up and down. You guys should start to feel the tingle from those ankles all the way through those hamstrings to the bottom of that fanny. Four, three, hold it at the top and pulse it. Squeeze, squeeze. Tummy's in. Nice flat back. You're balancing that full tray of champagne flutes filled to the brim. Lift and lower. Up. Up. You guys feel this? Up. Down. You should feel that entire calf. Four. Three. Two. Hold it at the bottom. Keep those heels together. Take those toes out in a narrow V. Heels stay together. Lift and lower. Up. Up. Four. Three. Two. Hold it at the top. Tiny pulses. Up. 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 Inner part of those calves. You guys should feel them burning. They may feel like they're turning into a little knot. Squeeze. Eight more. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, singles up and down. It's lift and lower, lift and lower. 
Rolling all the way up into your highest heel. No one's going to walk around today. Up, up, four, three, two, one. Hold it down. Take those big toes. Glue them together. Push into the backs of those knees. Lift those heels up. Press it down, down. Press those heels down like you're pushing into thick mud. Press, press. Eight. Y'all should feel this burn. Don't stop when I do. Press, 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 press. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Lift and lower. It all the way up, all the way down. Just tap that mat and come right back up. Four, three, two, and one. All right, let's work into our quads in front of our legs right now. And we'll get the back side here in a second. So bring your back, elbows, hands onto your chair. If you don't like that, you can always just hold one side. You're going to take one leg. I don't care which one. Stabilizing leg has a tiny bend. Extend that one leg straight out, point that toe, and lift and lower. Belly's in nice and tight. You're still pushing those hips forward, keeping a flat back. Lift, 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 lift. Eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, hold it at the top, tiny pulses, up, up. So I don't care if that toe is right there on that floor, as long as that leg has extended, it's pinned straight, there's zero bend. You'll have time to release that contraction in a second, but you don't have to be all the way up here because probably you're going to bend it. Squeeze. into that standing leg. Keep that standing leg with a nice little bend. Hold it here and turn the little bend and straighten right back up. Even if it's right here. It's like that little tiny pebble that's going on that calm leg. You're dropping and it creates just a little ripple. So it's tiny little bend and stretch. Eight. Eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down. Shake those legs out. You guys should feel that from the top of that leg all the way down to the knee. Soften that standing leg. Extend that opposite leg. Pull that tummy in. Push those hips forward. Lift that leg straight up. Up. Lift. Lift. Lower. You're squeezing from the top of that quad all the way through that big toe. Up, down, up, down, lift, 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 four, three, two, hold it down. So sometimes to help with this, going to a back, keep pulsing, going to a wall and seeing how you have your arch and then actually pressing your back into that wall helps you see what you're supposed to feel by pulling that tummy in and pushing those hips forward, giving you that nice long spine. Eight. 
fold it straight up, a tiny little bend, and straighten it right back out. Don't bend your left arm in front of it. Nope, let's straighten it, fold it right back out. And you can see the heels and the movement. Four. Stretch, grab that foot into that um, same hand, pushing those hips forward, switching those legs. We're getting ready to go to the back side for some super fun times. All right. I'm going to have you guys come down. I'm going to explain this. You're going to come down onto your hands and knees. A little bit. I'm going to show you guys in all different directions. You're going to have that right for uh, that left forearm on the mat, right palm facing or pressing in. Right leg is going to work. Four each way. Listen to my count. I'm going to talk you through it. You're just going to bend that um, knee on that right side, point that toe, pull that belly in nice and tight. You're just going to press that toe up. Press and tap. Press and tap. All right, this time you're going to extend that leg out. Squeeze and press and bend. Squeeze and press and bend. Two, back to the beginning, bend down, press those toes up, lower down, press up, lower down, press up, lower down, press up. Now extend that leg, lower, press it out, lower, press it out. So all the while, you're also working into that right arm because you're pressing that right palm into that mat. Hold it up, pulse it eight. Seven, six, five. Act as if someone's pulling that big toe, straightening that leg as straight as you can go. Bend that knee down, press up, lower down, press up, lower down, press up, lower down, press up. Now leg straightens out, lower, press out, lower down, press out. Lower down, press out, lower down, hold it up, pulse eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, fourth set, down, lower up, lower, that means it's the fourth set, tap and press. Extend that leg, tap, press it out, tap, press out, tap, press out, hold it out there. You guys should feel that glute and that hamstring. Four, three, two, one, here we go, tap, press up. If you take my class, you guys know I have a true affinity for Justin Timberlake. Now straighten that leg and press it out. Tap and press. Tap and press. Last one. Tap. Hold it out there. Pulse it up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Bend that knee, tap, and press. That leg should be screaming at you right now. Tap, and press, tap, and press. Now extend, tap, X, 
extend, tap, extend, two, and one, hold it up there, tiny pulses, eight, seven, six, your last bit, four, three, two, one, bend that knee, sit into that hip, we got the other side, guys. Right forearm down, left palms pressing into that mat or floor. Press that um, right foot into that mat, point that left toe, pull that tummy in nice and tight. You're gonna press up and tap, press and tap. Coming after this song here, hold it out and pulse. It's going to be intense and fun. Four, three, two, second set. Tap and press. Tap and press. Tap and press. Tap and press. Extend that leg. Pulling that toe to the other side of the room. Pull that leg out there. Pulse it. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Bend that knee. Tap the knee. Press the floor. Tap and lift. Really long boot. Squeeze those cheeks. Tap and press. Tap and press it. Press it. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last set. Here we go. Tap and lift. Tap and lift. Tap and lift. and controlled. One more. Hold it. Pulse eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Come to the other side. Come to the end of this. Stretch those arms across from that body. Switch those sides. We are going to do something. Oh, this is going to be arms, legs, everything. I'm going to face you guys. I'll talk you through it. So I want everybody to lay flat on your tummies. That thumb line is right in line with your nipple line. Okay? So you're going to curl those left toes. We've got rock star coming on if you're listening to my playlist. Bring that right knee up towards that right elbow. You're going to need to be able to um, push up here. If you need to, I'll show you two options. You're going to push up, press back, lower, and lift. Pulse it four, four, three, two, and one. Then bring it in and down. Or keep that left knee up, press back, lower down, Lift up, pulse four, three, 
two, and one. Bring that knee in, drop down. Here we go. Lift, press back, tap, and lift. Call four, three, two, one. And pull it in and drop it down. Here we go. Lift. Up. I'll show you from the side. Down and tap. Call four. Three, two, bring that knee in, in, drop down. Now I'll show you with the knee. Lift, press back, tap down, lift up, pulse forward. Three, two, and one. Bring that knee in, drop down. Last one, pull up, press back, tap down, lift up, pulse forward. Three, two, one. Now carefully set that foot next to that. Um, one that's on the floor. Bring yourself forward. Drop down onto your chest. Opposite knee comes up towards that elbow. Curl those toes or get that knee ready. Tummy's in nice and tight. Here we go. Press up. Push back. Tap down. Lift up. Pulse forward. Three, two, and one. Bring that knee in and down. Press up. Scoot back. Tap down. Lift up. Pulse forward. Three, two, one. Knee comes in and down. Here we go. Up and back. Tap and lift. Pulse it forward. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Bring it in. Drop down. Press up. Push back. Tap down. Lift up. Pulse four. Three, two, and one. Bring it in. Drop it down. Last one. Press up. Push back. Tap down. Lift up. Four. onto your side. We're going to work um, planks and bridges. I feel it coming by the weekend is our song. You can keep that bottom knee down on that mat or you can stack or stagger those feet. Lift it up. You're going to scoop it down and lift. Tap and lift. Scoop under that arm, shooting that hip up towards that ceiling. Scoop and lift. Scoop and lift. Tummy's in. Four, three, two. Hold it up. Pulse it up. Up. So as you're pulsing those hips up, I want you guys to think about pinching. Rib cage to hip bone on that side closest to the floor. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop that hip. Come onto your back. Dig those heels into that mat. Lift those hips. Up, down, up, down. Squeeze those cheeks. And move into the beat. Forward. Three, two, hold it at the top. Tiny little squeezes. Up, up. You've got that lemon slice right there between those cheeks. Keep those hips pushed up nice and high and tight. Four, three, two, tap those knees, in, out, in, out, tap, tap, those hips stay lifted, eight, seven, I'm going to turn to face you, four, three, two, drop those hips back down to the ground, roll over onto the opposite side, opposite forearm, Choose your positioning, knee down or stack or stagger. Lift that arm, scoop down, lift up, scoop down, lift up, scoop and lift, scoop four more, four. If you're on your knees,
technique, you're still doing the same thing. You're just taking some of that pressure off of that upper body. Remember, hold it up. Pulse up. More pulses. Eight, seven, six, whoo! Four, three, two, and one. Lower it all the way down. Back onto that back. Dig those heels in. Lift those hips. Up, down. Up, up, up. You're barely going all the way down. You're maybe going halfway down to that back. Squeezing right back up. 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 Everything's tight the whole time. Don't forget to breathe. Four, three. Hold it up and squeeze, 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 squeeze. Tiny little squeezes on that lemon slice. It's right there between your cheeks. Squeeze, squeeze. Let out a yelp if you need to. Please tell me I'm not the only one. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Tap those knees. Tap, tap. Four, three, two, one. Lower all the way down. Ooh, make sure felt everything. All right, if you've got your um, weights nearby, grab those again. Again, this is optional, so we're going to work some chest here. You're going to have those weights in each hand. Those knees are bent in a tabletop, so not over those belly buttons. Push those toes out so those knees are over the hip flexors, okay? Your back is pressed into the mat. You've got goalpost arms. You're just going to press those arms. And down. Press. So remember, squeeze through those muscles, whether you're holding weights or not. You guys are engaging those arms. Think about that chest, armpit to armpit. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Hold the arms down. Now tap those toes. Tap, tuck, working into those bellies. Tap and tap. Alternating. Those knees don't change shape. You're tapping with the toe. You're not dropping the toe. You're tapping out. Back's pressed in that mat. Four, three. Arms and legs. Tap. Alternate those legs as you tap up and bring those arms down. Up and down. Core, lower body, upper body. Four, three, two, one. Hold those legs. Bring those palms together right above those chests. Fly out and in. You've got that tiny soft bend in those arms. Out and in. Like you're hugging that tree. Those arms up, just those toes tap, 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 tap. Press that back in. 
into that mat, pushing those toes away from that body. Four, three, two, and one, release. Keep those feet right there on that floor. Hands come behind that head. Press that back into that mat. Your face is going to be looking straight to the ceiling the whole time, so do not drop that chin to your chest at all. Those elbows stay nice and wide. You're just going to lift up and up. Lift and lift. Up and up. Press that back into that mat harder every single time. Four, three. Those elbows nice and wide. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, just hold it. Lower and lift. Here we go. Down and up. All right, you're going to add a twist. Left shoulder to right knee. Down and up. Pressing that right side harder into that mat. Elbow stays nice and wide. Continuously moving this entire song, working into that core. Down and up. Four more. Down and up. Two. Hold it up and pulse that shoulder. Pulse that knee in. Tiny little pinches. You should feel that whole right side pinching in. Lift. Eight. Hold it. Four. Three. Two. Lower it all the way down. Drop that foot. Curl to that left side. Right shoulder to left knee. Up and down. Lift. Lift. Two, one, hold it up, tiny pulses, up, up. Press that side tight onto that mat. Squeeze, squeeze. Oh. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Eight more. Seven, six, five. Four, three, two, hold. Let that body just melt into your mat. Place your hands where you would like them. Let those hands move in and out from side to you. Let them move to side. Nice deep breaths in. Left hand takes that right hand and draws it slowly to that left side. Keep both those shoulder blades on that mat. Nice stretch here. Keep that right hand into the chest. Keep that right hand up. Lift that right hand. 
Keeping both those shoulder blades on that mat. You want to really feel that stretch into that hip flexor. Okay, so keep those knees way back in front of the center. Bring that right knee in to meet it. Hug those knees nice and tight. Hands come behind those knees. Back yourself up to seated. Extend those legs. Flex those feet. Feel that stretch all the way through those uh, the back of those legs. And that's going to be my butt. Okay, flat back forward. Ah, oh, this should feel good. Bring those ankles all the way through those hamstrings. Keep those feet flexed. Inhale back up one more time. Nice deep breath. And flat back towards those legs. And now round into it. Reaching for the shins, ankles, or bottoms of those feet. Dropping that nose down towards those knees. Pull that belly button in nice and tight and slowly roll yourself up to seated. Roll those shoulders down and in those pockets. Bend those knees. I'm going to face you guys. Come onto those toes into a nice low squat. Separate those feet just outside those hips. Those palms or fingertips are pressed into that floor. Flatten those feet. Shoot those hips up. Straighten those legs. Rock side to side. Now pull that belly button spine and slowly release it. Keep those arms moving. That's how we're going to go back to where we were. Take a nice deep breath. And exhale. And give yourself a round of applause. You guys did awesome. Thank you so much for being with me today. I hope you enjoyed it. Drop a comment and let me know what you think.